Hey Animal Adventurers, well, welcome to our Raven Avery. Let me introduce you to Ray and Charles. Uh, these guys are just starting their training with me. And actually this is their old Avery. We're going to be refurbishing this uh, fairly soon. So we've made a few changes and uh, let me show you, you where they are now. So from the old Avery, we actually moved the Ravens to these new Averys. So this is because um, we noticed uh, Ray had a little bit of feather damage and we weren't sure if it was Charles being a little bit uh, of a bully towards her. And um, this can happen sometimes. And um, we actually noticed him being a little bit aggressive, particularly during training sessions. He was trying to take Ray's food. He was trying to dominate things. So we've actually, although we split them up, we've put a little window in between them so they can still interact with each other, but it just keeps Ray a little bit safer, which is very important, of course. So this is the um, plan for now, but they're actually having their old aviary being rebuilt with a separate window so that we can actually let them in together, but we can kind of supervise them at the same time. Now the first goal with Ray is to get her to weigh on these scales. So I'm actually gonna use the target stick, uh, which she quite likes to follow and touch because she knows she gets a reward of food. And the goal is to drink, just to bring her a little bit closer to the scales. We need to do the same thing with Charles, uh, but he's a little bit less accepting of the scales. As you can see, he's a little bit unsure. So I'm gonna try a slightly different approach. Now up on the left uh, with the window shelf that he has that he can look through to Ray. Um, this is actually his favourite shelf, so I thought I'd put them on the shelf and see if he was a little bit more accepting. Now I thought I, this actually worked rather well. Um, Charles, although he's not sitting fully on the scales, he's got one leg on, one leg off. Uh, this is a good start. He's um, a little bit more accepting of them, and I'm hopeful that if he puts his other foot up, then I can actually reward him with a piece of food. But Charles has other ideas and um, yeah, he decides to lift the lid of the scales and throw them on the floor. But a short time later, Charles decides that the scales are actually okay and he sits on them and gets a big reward for doing so. So today we're gonna to be bringing Dolly and Izzy in with the Ravens and they're gonna be their main trainers. They're gonna be um, doing the targeting. Dolly starts off targeting Ray up onto the log a nice reward and then we switch to the scales and then when Ray steps onto the scales she gets another much bigger reward. So we keep on with this uh, as you can see Ray is a little bit unsure still of the scales but she's getting a lot more confident and it's exactly what we want so we want to try and reward her each time that she steps fully onto the scales and this is really good progress. I think she'll probably uh, sit on them probably very soon. As you can see, she's getting braver and braver. So we gave her some blueberries. This is one of her favorite foods. And she takes them off. And then the very next day, the first thing she did was go straight to the scales. She's a pretty smart bird. In fact, it was pretty hard to get her off the scales. <laughs> Today is a cleaning day and myself and Carl, who is one of our volunteers, will be doing the cleaning. Uh, the Ravens absolutely love Carl. Um, and while this is going on, Dolly is going to be training them. So this is actually a great way to desensitize the Ravens to having people in their enclosure. Uh, and while we do the cleaning, um, Dolly will be training and of course rewarding the Ravens. As we finish up the cleaning, you can see that Ray is perfectly content. She's got lots of uh, food from her training session and this is exactly how we want it to be. So the long-term goals with Ray and Charles are to get them out here into the flying area. This is gonna take a fair bit of time um, and we are actually gonna build this up on a, a slow basis. We're gonna try to get them um, initially to go into their travel boxes and uh, then we are having a specialized indoor area built for um, well not just the ravens but for a lot of the birds to use um, so we can actually work, we can actually bring them out when it's raining um, 
and we actually fly them indoors as well. So meanwhile, uh, Charles has been watching Ray making her progress on the scales, and as you can see, uh, he's gone straight down as well. The ravens often do learn from each other, which is very helpful indeed. So then Charles's trainer Izzy is coming in, and she's doing some targeting work with him. We've got a little bit of an audience outside, which is good yep. as well. And this is Charles making some really good progress with. So as the training sessions went so well, we've got some enrichment, which are puzzle devices that have some little sprinklings of food hidden inside. And the ravens have to work out uh, how to get to the food. But as you'll see, the ravens very much enjoy this. Okay, now it's enrichment time. So this little puzzle device is for Charles. And uh, he's a bit unsure at first, so I quickly just show him where the food is. And uh, yeah, he gets this game very quickly indeed. One of our trainers, Jade, puts the puzzle in for Ray. And uh, she's a little bit quicker to work things out than uh, Charles. She's straight in, works out this food involved. And uh, as you can see, she's uh, very much enjoying finding that food. I really hope you enjoyed meeting our ravens today. We've got loads more content to come with the ravens and the other birds at the sanctuary. So make sure you subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.